Here in Antwerp, members of the Jewish community have come together with politicians and visiting ambassadors to remember the events of 70 years ago in the Warsaw Ghetto. Well, it's an annual event, but of course this year we have a special reason to commemorate the Warsaw Ghetto Uprising. But this event takes place every year, and every year it's important because every single day the Jewish community of this country and across Europe has a reason to think about what happened. We don't need a special day, but it's good that it takes place because then the entire community can still be remembered of what happened. Now this is the Jewish population of Antwerp remembering something that happened, on in, happened in Poland. Why is that important? Well, because the Germans actually didn't make any difference between Jews in Poland and Belgium. They were launching a war against the Jewish people. That's what Hitler officially declared. And whether they lived in Poland or Belgium doesn't make any difference. After all, the Belgian Jews and the Jews from Holland and from all over Europe actually died in concentration camps which were located in Poland. A moving moment of the ceremony was U.S. Ambassador to Belgium, Howard Gutmann, sharing his Jewish heritage, explaining how as a boy his father had to hide from the Nazis in the Polish woods. I did want to say a few words today, uh, mainly for the benefit uh, of the children, to tell not about the planet that we were, not about the planet uh, that is past, but the, about the planet we can be. Because on this 70th anniversary, I wanted to tell about a 70th anniversary memorial trip I took last October. That people had come from Australia, from Canada, from the US, from the UK, to Bialorowska. And then he said, and today is the most important day in the history of Bialorowska. For today is the first time we've ever been visited by a US ambassador. So 70 years after Gitman Mogulnitsky spent 27 months hiding in the woods of Bialorowska, his son's return to the town was the most important day in the history of the town. We can be a better planet. Thanks so much. All the best. Why are the Jews in Antwerp commemorating what happened in Warsaw? Because the uprising of Warsaw is a symbolic for the Jewish people. It means that people didn't want just to die. They fought for their lives. They fought for their livelihoods. They fought for their honor. And they knew that they were dying. So it is very symbolic. And in this symbol is what marks the Jewish people all around the world. A very moving ceremony, remembering the courage of people 70 years ago who gave everything for what they believed in. This is Colin Stevens for JN1 in Antwerp.